Manta, manta, sve mi se manta kad vidim te Manta, 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 da li i tebi manta se? We are here in uh, Fishuk today to discuss uh, some uh, options related to various projects that you are intending to do. Could you briefly tell me what you'd like to do with uh, Mrs. Mrs. Rasnatovich? Mrs. is now in, a, in house arrest after reaching a plea bargain and meeting some kind of embezzlement or maybe some possession of illegal arms. Well, in any so case, it so would be good to clubs related to sexual exhibition industry to invite her and ask the authorities to ease the house arrest because I understand that she is allowed to appear in concerts. So to invite her to sing because uh, her singing, her concerts also have a sex exhibition element. Okay. What is the full name of this lady that we are speaking about? Svetlana Tsetsa, as she is known, Tsetsa Raznatovich. I don't know her previous uh, name, I mean, before she married Zelko Raznatovich, known as Arkan. I mean, he was Arkan and she was Tsetsa. That is how they are known. But, uh, okay, so she's from where? She's from Serbia, of course. Yes. Who, who is Arkan? Arkan was um, was a founder and commander of what was called the Serbian Armed Guard or something like that. That was better known as the Tigers, and I think he also raised tigers, which is something uh, unique. I mean, raising lions is also unique, but. You know, the nature of tigers is also uh, difficult to raise. Yes, so as I understand, uh, as I mentioned, I think uh, if the authorities in Serbia, today's authorities, would realize that people are interested in uh, Mrs. Raznetovic's performance and uh, what happens to her, so they are likely to ease the conditions of house. Okay, so who is the current government of uh, Serbia? Uh, that is unfortunate, but it is the so-called Democratic Party. Now, what happened to Arkan? Arkan was assassinated probably by some kind of uh, an underground organization for some disagreement. And who are the Dakians? Ah, the Dakians were... the Dakians are the original Romanians. Dakia was a country, and after when? it... Uh, before it was conquered by the Roman Empire, up to the beginning of the second century. And uh, afterwards, after uh, a while, the people of... Dakia, uh, the former Dakia, who were regarded as Romanians or Valachians. But yes, and then there was Valachia in Romania. It, in Romanian, it was called Tsare Romaneste, uh, the land of the Romanians, and then Moldavia and Transylvania. But it's all ro a Romanian population. They speak. Romanian, which is a mixture of Slavic words, uh, Dakian words, but especially, I would say, Roman. In other words, uh, Latin or Italian? Yes. It comes from... Um, More Latin than Latin, Italian. Latin, yes. which uh, later evolved into Italian in Italy and um, other... Romanesque languages. Yes. So, okay, to the next part. You are making a film, or you're making a number of films, and you are looking for actors and actresses in these films. Is that correct? Yes. What is your first requirement? 
Well, uh, that depends to what movie. I'm making a movie called Dracula's Rebirth to the Sleeping Beauty. I mean, it begins with the true story of Dracula, Prince Vlad III of Valachia. Then uh, it goes to the Sultan of Morocco in the late 17th century and the early 18th century. Ismail the Bloodthirsty, who is who was also uh, well part of the history of slave trading in Morocco. Briefly, the history of uh, people who lived under the Ottoman Empire, and then it comes to the 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 fictional part of the reborn Dracula to the Sleeping Beauty. Okay, so why are you making a movie about this? Uh, so it is, uh, it is a mixture of history and fiction. So there are a few reasons for that. One reason may be um, for parents to educate and guide their children so they will not be gangsters. Then it goes back to the uh, history of uh, of Zelko Raznyatovich, known as Arkan, because his parents were strict and communists, and they actually um, physically abused their children, physically abused him, so he ran to other places and actually became a gangster. Then afterwards he somehow repented and became a politician. The main purpose of the movie is for parents to educate their children and guide their children so they can prevent them from being, from becoming gangsters. Okay. Because this is a problem lately. Yes, then there is the movie, a kind of good and bad and the ugly, or maybe something like the good, the bad, and Mrs. Honey, or something like that. I mean, the good is Mrs. Raznatovich, the bad is Mrs. Jinjic, and the ugly is Mrs. Honey. How did I came to that um, kind of an uh, idea? Because really, Mrs. Raznatovich uh, lived with her husband. Uh, she got married five years before he got assassinated. So, in a sense, she's the most uh, unfortunate one of the three regarding to their husband's assassinations. And nevertheless, she looks to me, uh, and sounds to me, I mean, I would regard her as the coolest of all. Okay, so, who is Mrs. Jinjic? Uh, the wife of... Uh, the one who called himself Serbia's Prime Minister, who was actually Serbia's dictator, Djindjic. Okay, and Mrs. Hani? Who uh, is that? In South Africa, the widow of... Uh, that filthy the, ter uh, you mean the filthy terrorist, don't you? Yes, I actually mean that, yes. Okay. I would say that, yes, that's a good uh, uh, description, yes. Okay, so now some of these uh, ladies that we wish to uh, entice um, or employ or consider as uh, people that should be auditioned for their role in this film. Yes. Are you going to pay them and how much will you pay them? When the movie is completed, then I would obviously pay the people who performed. How much? Well, people can negotiate, but uh, I can assure you that when there is a movie and when I earn something from it, I will, I will at least offer those people who performed in it some money. I mean, they may accept, they may decide not to accept, but I would definitely offer something. Okay, are you making this movie with the motive of uh, business-minded profit 
orientation? Oh, I have this in mind too, but uh, I think my main motive is... Uh, I mean, that idea of Mrs. Razniatovich is the coolest of those three. And, in a way, the most unfortunate. So, are you saying that the, 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 the motivation for this movie is to tell people that Mrs. Raznatovich is cool and she's unfortunate? In other words, what you... In, in a, in, in a I mean, cool, maybe we'll say cool despite being unfortunate, yes. Okay, so in another way, are you saying that the opposite extreme is the bad is the luckiest? The bad and the ugly, and in some way the luckiest, yes. I mean, uh, when I say the ugly, I mean, it's like, um, I say the bad, actually. I mean, not physically, I mean, but uh, I can't say about uh, Mrs. I mean, it would sound strange if you look at uh, the pictures of Mrs. Jinjic to say, to call her the ugly. Let's see, so that is why I chose it that way. Okay, so what will you do with this movie when it is complete? Where are you going to go with it? To relevant uh, producers or to relevant businessmen, men or maybe politicians to uh, find a way to show it to the world or to show it to the relevant parts of the world. I mean, maybe in Serbia, the good, the bad and the ugly, maybe in Romania, Dracula's rebirth to the Sleeping Beauty, or in other, and in South Africa, both we can show, and in other parts of the world. Are you making this movie, or these movies, in English? Yes. It is easier for me to make it in English, yes. So, will you uh, translate them into Romanian and Serbian? Or yes. get somebody to do that? Yes, I think so. Yes. Okay. That would be uh, the best thing to do, actually, yes. Okay. Good. Thank you, then. Um, there's nothing else I can think about that we should discuss now. All right, so have a nice day. You're right, thank you, and you too. All right.